Everyone, please help me in welcoming our guest, Off The Wire alum and YouTube extraordinaire, Jenny Lorenzo. <laughs> so welcome to the show, Jenny. This, hey. this is not your first time on the stage. No. Were you here as a guest, or when, when have you been here before? Um, I was an Off The Wire head writer, uh, 2009 through 2010, and I did a lot of sketches and absurdities. Awesome. We're going to take a look at that real quick. <laughs> Are you? And what are you doing under the desk? Uh, my name is Stephanie, and I'm your biggest fan. <laughs> okay, I slept over here, but I got it through the pipes, but it was really uncomfortable because the first time I got stuck in a vending machine, don't ask me how, and then the second time I ended up in the boys' bathroom and saw some people doing stuff. Sex. Um, Can we get this girl out of here, please? Oh, no, Somebody? No, 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 ben, please, ben, please, ben, please, <sighs> please. Okay, you can stay just because you're really uncomfortable and I feel like it's gonna get much worse if I kick you out. <laughs> Sit in the last row, okay? And you don't need to breathe like that. It's making me very uncomfortable. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> You're not moving. Can I have some of your beard hair? What? No. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right, so I have to ask, what, what's more comfortable, the chairs or the old red couch? I like the old red couch. I'm not sure why they got rid of it exactly. I know. But um, I definitely prefer the couch. No. So now you've made it from, you know, small time, off the wire gigs to the big time. What do you do now? Well, if you consider YouTube big time, um, I, I have a lot of fun doing all sorts of, you know, things. But I do Geekgasm right now, which is through aggressive comics. And I talk about all sorts of nerd things. I rage about things. I hate Michael Bay. Might as well just let that out right now. Um, and I also like to do parodies. So, okay. Yeah. We're also going to take a look at that. Check it out. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice! Salutations, geeklings, and welcome to another aggressive comics presents Geek Gas. Let our powers combine and form Captain Planet! The show that made you feel kind of guilty for throwing your empty Dunkaroos package onto the ground in the park. I would like a true classic Nick channel. Not just some late night blog here or there, okay? I'm talking about an actual classic Nick. Just fucking do it already! <laughs> Who's a cute little troll? Who's a cute little troll? <laughs> Evening, Commissioner. You are no April O'Neil! You're cool but rude. Give me a break. La, 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 la. However, I can't help but think that this project should stay dead, trapped in a containment unit in the depths of Hollywood. Just, yeah, yeah. Because my life is a dark room. One big dark room. You are so beautiful to me. Stay geeky, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> So what it seems like to me is that just because I'll be graduating in another semester doesn't mean I have to stop just doing weird stuff. No, you should do weird stuff until the day you die. Okay. And even in the afterlife, just freak people out. Mm -hmm. what, what do you think started the, like, how long have you liked to just kind of make things? Um, actually, really when I started here at UM, um, I just wanted to be an actor and then I became a writer and I don't know, it just became fun to like work with people and everybody has like a different sense of humor and personality to bring into the mix, so I love it and I just want to keep doing it. So So judging by the video and from the, the episodes that I've watched online, you really like the 90s. Yes. Do you think the 90s are better than today? What, what, what caused your obsession with the 90s? I don't know. I mean, I know you like people tend to be nostalgic about the past and w right now this is going to be the past, you know, 10 years from now we're going to be all nostalgic about now, but I think the 90s it was just so tacky and bizarre, and like everybody felt really awkward. It was an awkward time for Clarissa. It was an awkward time for Beavis and Butthead. I don't know. It's just, it's fun to delve into that. 
Uh, my friend has a theory about a certain 90s show and that when you say it, just all the girls scream. So I'm going to test it out and see what happens. Doug. <laughs> you know. Why do people love Doug so much? Well, I like the beats. Um, Doug was okay. Patty Mayonnaise was... George is a, a fan, I see. Of, <laughs> um, I was actually a huge, huge fan of Beetlejuice. That so, scared me a little bit too much. A little too much? Mm -hmm. the, the movie or the animated the series? The animated series. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So I even dress up as Lydia. Yeah, it's fun. L uh, Lydia, Lydia uh, of Clams. L yeah, Lydia of Clams. Um, so this is our space episode. I want to ask you all about uh, nerd stuff, movies, and space. But we're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back with more Jenny Lorenzo. Cool. 